Boom! What's going on guys? Byron Rogers here with Bravo Research Group and Executive Protection Lifestyle. I'm excited because I have just put together what I believe is the ultimate carry gun. Yup. Check this out. Boom. I call it the P10C Hotel. P10, the CZ P10C Hybrid and it's a thing of beauty. So check out what I've done. <clears throat> Woo! Clear, right? Shock lock. I think that this is a fantastic gun. In fact, I have uh, a Glock 17 as well as a Glock 19 that is are both tier one salient Glocks, and I personally believe that my P10C series outperforms both of those guns. Now don't get me wrong, I love my salient Glocks. They've been amazing guns to me. I'm gonna keep them, you can't have them, I'm not selling them. But as we all know, over the trajectory of a shooter's lifespan, we move from one gun to another based on where we're at, our ergonomics, and just what works and what fits. For me personally, right now, the CZ P10 series is where I am at. But make no mistake, my salient Glocks are absolutely amazing firearms and I'm not getting rid of them. The considerations I'm giving you here are simply personal preferences. So don't get carried away. The trigger to me, is smoother. The crisp pop, reset, and that's it. That's stock. Reset, boom, it's crisp. Nice and heavy the way I like it, but not too heavy. Reset, that's all I'm doing. What I noticed about this gun instantly when I touched it was that the ergonomics in terms of the way, the degree of the angle of the uh, lower frame here. The pistol grip was a lot like a Glock. However, um, they rounded things off so that it actually fit in my hand more comfortably. The back strap uh, is more robust than my Glocks. This, this whole area here is nice and smooth. They even got the grip up here for my finger. I like my front serrations. And so the second I touched this weapon, I noticed it was a, a very similar, if not the same grip, grip angle as a Glock, but at the same time, um, it was definitely more comfortable. At this point in time, I'm over 3,000 rounds through this gun. So I feel that the grip on this thing has been more than adequate. I've shot in lots of competitions with it, um, and we've just taken it to the range and pushed it, pushed it past the spaces. So I instantly loved the uh, just the ergonomics of the weapon. I like to punch my hand out and be behind the gun as if I'm throwing a punch, boom. Um, I'm not a big fan of the weapons that I have to like kind of more 90 degrees, can't my wrist back. I feel like it's not as strong because my wrist is just forward as if I'm throwing a punch. So I like, the weapons with more aggressive grip angles for those reasons. So what I did here was I took my CZ P10C, which I really liked because it was a lot like the Glock 19, which in my opinion was the perfect carry gun. The other thing I noticed instantly was how flat it shoots. This gun, the recoil on it, the way they design it, I don't know if it's something having to do with the weight and the extra little like alien head, back of the alien head nub they put over here. Um, but the CZ P10C was so flat. The way it moved was so flat that I was just like blown away. So I went back and I shot a steel uh, stage in, in the competition I was on, and I actually shot better iron sights with the CZ P10C than I was actually able to execute it with this dot on my salient tier one uh, Glock 17. So that was awesome. So like, like, like I went and I shot my first stage with that gun. Um, I was amazed. So that was the first thing I noticed. Those were the first couple things I noticed. 
but the way that this thing was running so flat, man, just it haunted me in my dreams. And I remember just seeing in my mind, like the sights just moving just back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, as if nothing was really happening. Like, like, yeah, and I was able to stay on target. And that's really kind of what haunted me about how much I like the CZP-10C. Then beyond that, I went on ahead and kicked it up a notch. A friend told me a nasty little rumor about how I could actually get the CZP-10F and throw the F slide on the CZP-10C, which would make it the CZP-10, what I call the CZP-10H, the CZP-10 Hotel, the CZP-10 Hybrid. And that is what I've created, and I've put a few thousand rounds through it, and I absolutely love it. It is the best of both worlds. It's the CZP-10 uh, uh, F slide, which then is the shorter, more easily concealable slide because it's got the shorter hand handle because the CZ CZP-10F uh, has that long, big handle to go with those deep magazines, or I think they're like 19 round mags. And the CZP-10F uh, though has that long slide with the uh, longer barrel on it. So you're actually getting the longer barrel here with the shorter handle here. One of the other reasons I think this pistol is dang near perfect is because you're getting all of the um, um, concealability of the CZP-10C here in the grip, along with the length of the barrel of the CZP-10F for the extra little bit of accuracy and the little things like that um, that you want a longer barrel for. It's the best of both worlds without getting too technical. I threw a little weapon light on, for, on it for, uh, you know, doing my CCW stuff, whipping it out, small rooms, whatever, and what you gotta do. I don't have a crystal ball, so I carry a weapon light, because I don't know if I'll need it, but I'd rather have it and not need it. I threw a Delta Point, a loophole Delta Point on it. Boom, and I love it, man. Uh, and this is my new carry gun. Uh, to be entirely honest with you, I do know that the, uh, this Delta Point Pro has been fantastic. I've shot many competitions with it, um, but there's a high chance I'm gonna change the Acro because the Acro um, doesn't have a failure point that most red dots do have that I have personally ran into. I was shooting a competition in the rain and when my optic got full of, got some water on it, it actually caused my red dot to show up as like a big red star, which is unacceptable. So I'm gonna try the Acro out and I will let you guys know how I like it. But for now, I just wanna let you guys know the CZ P10H, the CZ P10 Hybrid Hotel is a thing. It is a real thing. So try it out, check it out. Let me know if you like it as much as I do. I absolutely love it. And this right here is gonna be my new carry gun for a while. This is Byron Rogers with Executive Protection Lifestyle and Bravo Research Group. I will see you on the next video or the podcast out.